After celebrating my last challenge victory, I took to the streets, oozing confidence and sex appeal. To my surprise, females did not respond to my pure alpha presence the way I imagined. This shock took me for a downward spiral into a great depression and self-isolation tendencies. Now, with the pandemic on our hands, what better than to practice the same social distancing behaviors in game two? Can you win a game of Fall Guys without touching anyone? To answer this contagious plot, we must first understand the challenge and levels that are impossible to complete. The levels that bunch players up like Block Party, Slime Climb, and DoorDash are not impossible but will make this challenge very frustrating. Technically, all games are doable besides the grab tail games, since touching is illegal in this challenge. With Royal Fumble out as a finale possibility, that leaves three of the four final games remaining. Before we start, here are the ground rules. You can't touch another person at all in any level, beginning to end. Let's do this. Starting in the back row is ideal for this challenge. But when you find yourself in the middle row, dive over the crowd to gain ample space. Now, simply choose your gaps to take to avoid contact, and you're home free. Easy. I will look for you. I will find you. And I will kill you. Fuck off. Other players grabbing you will be a major problem for this challenge and easily the most frustrating obstacle we will have to overcome. It only took one game to find a challenge I overlooked. Finish Line Griefers. This challenge will be more frustrating than I could imagine. I would constantly run into difficult levels to avoid others mid-run, like Block Party, if no one was grabbing, which made this challenge seem increasingly difficult. Would the RNG gods bless me or laugh as I continue to torment myself with these challenges? Go on. Mock me. Laugh. <laughs> God. That was God laughing at me through that through that obscene giggle. The gods didn't laugh long, however, as I made my first finals appearance. After taking care of Zeus and all other RNG gods, games started going my way more often. And on my second finals appearance, I was granted an opportunity for victory in Hexagon. All right, nobody spawned near me, so this is good. Take the outside, try to cut off that bird. All right, a lot of people are falling, this is good, this is good. Uh, oh, oh my god. They already almost all fell. Oh my god, this might be an easy victory. Oh my god, second try? No way. No way. Alright, just fall straight down. Nobody's on this floor! Oh my god, here it is. Easy to... Oh, uh, stop talking. You stop talking. Fuck! Fuck, fuck, fuck! Okay, oh, oh my, oh my god. Oh my god, no. Don't end like this. Alright, I need to take out the middle. Take out the middle. Oh, 
I don't like being on the same side of this bird. Let's ditch this side, go to the other side. Oh, I should probably cut that bird off so he can't jump to my side. Uh, screw it, screw it, screw it. Focus on myself, focus on myself. I knew it! I should have jumped on there. Wait! He fell! Oh my god. Oh my god. I got... I got this. T two more people, two more people. Play it safe. Play it safe. One more person. Oh my god! No way! Second try on the fight. Oh no! Oh my god! <laughs> to answer the question, can you win a game of Fall Guys without touching anyone? The answer is yes. But not trolling or hugging jelly beans makes me lonely and more depressed. Is it really worth it?